it's Brittany. So you're probably wondering why I'm dressed like Donatello, not Donatello, Donatello, I meant. Um, it's because I just got back from the advanced screening of the Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie that just came out, well today, as you're watching it, it's Friday, but I saw it on Thursday at 7 o'clock. It was, it was a really good movie and I went there dressed as Donatello, of course, because he's my favorite turtle, as you guys know. And I also have my Donatello backpack on, if you see it. Isn't that like, really cute? People are staring at me at the movies and I'm just like, whatever. I wanted to go all out. I even have like my little purple cuffy things and you know my top and yeah so I just kind of wanted to be in my Donatello costume. I've been wearing this all day because I'm just like so excited about it. So let me know if you guys have seen the movie and tell me what you guys think. So anyways there's two things I want to talk about in this video. I want to talk about that ghost picture, well, two ghost pictures that I showed you guys in my last video about the orbs and then I want to talk about the game Baby Blue but first I want to talk about the pictures because ever since I uploaded that video every single comment and I've been getting so many tweets from you guys about this one thing that I never even noticed but I want you guys to know that I have noticed. I've replied to everybody who's mentioned it and I'm just like, oh my God, it's actually like really scary. You saw a woman or a man, some face of a ghost standing in the window that I told you guys about, about this like woman that stands in the window and looks at you. And now at first when, I, when you guys said that and I saw the first person that mentioned it and I paused the video and then some of you guys have been sending me the picture and circling it with a red circle showing me the ghost face and I was like, oh my god, it's actually a face. Like if you look at it, it's actually a face. At first I thought it was the reflection of the woman. As you can see, the woman is near the window and I thought it was just like her reflection. But if you look, there's like, it looks like the face has no body like the reflection and it doesn't even look like the woman and also the face is actually facing me like it's looking at my camera and it's not facing the woman's way like how her reflection would be that is like the creepiest face that i've ever seen so thank you to all of you who actually have good eyes and saw it and like showed me and circled it being like there's a woman looking at you i was like who's looking at me like that is just really scary but i just wanted to address that because that is actually like that is freaky and that woman or I think it looks like a woman <laughs> that face has no body like it's just it's really weird and the face is looking at me well looking at my camera which is like you know on me so yes I just wanted to tell you guys like I noticed that and now I'm like freaking out about it it's actually like making me really excited I'm just like oh my god I caught like a ghost lady on camera well, I can't confirm that but that's what I think so we'll just go with that. So thank you guys so much for watching that video of mine. And thank you for showing me that crazy ghost person in the window. Moving on to the next thing I want to talk about is another paranormal game, which is called Baby Blue. This is a very freaky game and a lot of you guys have been requesting it for me to play. And I am going to play it, of course. And I have the instructions on my laptop in front of me. So the Baby Blue game, oh, it's also called blue baby baby blue or blue baby you have to go into the bathroom on your own and you have to turn off all the lights and lock the door behind you all right so like right now it's starting to sound like bloody mary then you stare into the mirror hold out your arms like you were rocking a baby and repeat the words baby blue blue baby 13 times without making a mistake all right you will suddenly feel the weight of an invisible baby in your arms. The baby will get heavier and heavier as it grows larger and larger. You will feel it scratching your arms. What? Before it gets too heavy, you have to quickly take the invisible baby, flush it down the toilet, and run out of the bathroom. If you don't do it fast enough, a hideous woman will appear in the mirror. She will yell, give me back my baby, and scream loud enough to break glass. <laughs> if you are still holding the baby, she will kill you. Now that's not a laughing matter at the end right there. Okay, so this says, according to the legend, a group of girls found out about the blue baby story and decided to try it out. They didn't believe it would work. 
So they sent their friend Laura into the bathroom on her own. She turned the lights off and closed the door behind her. Laura put out her arms and started chanting the phrase, blue baby, baby blue. All of a sudden, a baby appeared in her arms and began scratching her. Laura was scared out of her wits and had no idea what to do. She wanted to drop it and run. She just stood there holding the invisible baby as it grew heavier and heavier. Suddenly, she caught sight of something horrible in the bathroom mirror and screamed in terror. When Laura's friends heard her screaming, they tried to open the bathroom door, but it was locked. Finally, they managed to run into a friend's house to get help. When they broke open the door, they found Laura lying dead on the bathroom floor and her eyes had been scratched out. So that is, that is a very creepy game and it reminds me a lot of Bloody Mary because Bloody Mary supposedly scratches your eyes out if she like sees you in the mirror. And um, Bloody Mary update, since you guys saw that I played the Bloody Mary game, uh, she didn't appear. A lot of you though keep telling me you saw her in the video. I don't know if you're just like joking or like lying to me because I don't see anything there but a lot of you are like, I see a girl standing behind you in a white dress and I'm like, what? I don't know if it was like my camera person, like Jesse, he was wearing white and like black pants. So I don't know if you guys thought Jesse was Bloody Mary because you can kind of see him in the mirror and I can kind of see how you would think it looks like Bloody Mary because it's like, you know, just the white part and like Jesse's really tall and I picture Bloody Mary to be really tall. So it could have been him, but I don't know. Some of you said you saw a face in the mirror. Like that doesn't look like my face. I was like, what? Like, I don't know what you're talking about. Are you guys lying to me? Are you joking? Oh my God. Like there's a lot of comments and it's like, you know, it's really creepy. And also I said at the end of that video that Bloody Mary tends to haunt you in your dreams if she didn't appear in the mirror. I've had no dreams, but last night I had like a really creepy dream. I don't even really remember what happened. I just remember this one part. I was like in a library or something and there was this creepy woman that was like staring at me and I remember my heart was just pounding and like racing. Like I was, I was having so much anxiety, like I was scared. Like I felt like my heart was like coming out of my chest and this woman just like kept looking at me and like every time I looked up, she'd be closer to me. It was, it was really weird. I remember I woke up and like I couldn't even really breathe. It was like, it was a weird nightmare I had. I don't know if I ate something that caused me to have bad dreams. Usually if I eat cheese before bed, then like, you know, I just have the weirdest messed up dreams ever, but you know. So anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you like my Donatello costume. Let me know if you guys dressed up like Donatello, if you dressed up like Raphael or Leonardo or Michelangelo or Splinter or whatever. Let me know if you did that to see the Ninja Turtles because I think it's awesome to dress up for movies. It's just so much fun and I love Halloween, so you know, I like to dress up. So, you know, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Stay tuned for my Baby Blue video, which I will be playing soon. I'll probably be like playing it this week, but I don't know if I'm gonna upload this video this week or next week because it's Friday as you're watching this. I'll probably like play it this weekend and I might upload it next week because I have other videos that I wanna do like before that, like upload before that, so I don't know, we'll see. But it's gonna come up really soon, so stay tuned for that. All of my links are in the description below. If you want some Brittie 44 merchandise, then you can go to customizegirl.com slash s slash 44. And that is the end of my video. So thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you in Tuesday's video. Bye!